Hello, my name is Michael Hubbard with VMware, and I'm here with Raghu Raghuram. And today we're going to chat about the confluence we're seeing of technology, process and operating changes, as well as financial implications of the software-defined data center through the innovations of technology from VMware and from its partners. Raghu, what are we seeing today uh, on the technology side with customers? So the SDDC vision is very exciting to our customers because they see the prospect of transformative economic benefits, at the same time enabling them to move at the speed their business needs them to move at, right? And this combination of benefits has previously been very hard to combine. The STDC concept itself is a logical evolution of what they've gotten from VMware over the last decade. We virtualized servers and introduced a new operational model into the data center for compute. Now we're going to them and explaining how we can take the same operational model and the same principles of virtualization, apply that to storage, networking, and security, and tie it together with a new layer of management. This has gotten them really excited because the operational model for compute completely transformed the economics of compute, as well as the agility with which they were able to provision compute. Now imagine if you could apply that same level of agility and economic transformation to the entire data center. We are talking about millions and millions of dollars of economic benefit, at the same time being able to deliver services as fast or as faster than external cloud providers. VMware has matured to a point as a partner to our customers where our services organization is doing a fantastic job of bringing the learnings of the first movers to to the broader market on how to migrate workloads to this new environment, how to justify the financials of both CapEx and OpEx cost takeout uh, of that migration, and how to define a new operating model with new skill sets, new operators, new certifications, um, and in the extreme cases, even new organizational models uh, to support a software-defined data center on the consumption side uh, of the business consuming these services, and of course on the production side of how you actually deliver, create, and originate these services. Yes, the software-defined data center, much like the journey that the customers went through with virtualization, is a journey for the rest of the data center. And they're all at various starting points depending upon their level of virtualization. The question that we get invariably asked when we go talk about the software-defined data center is how do I get there, right? What are the next steps from a deployment model, from architecture, and most importantly, from operations and people in process? And I think that's where uh, your, your team's expertise is going to be really valuable for our customers. What my team's seeing with customers today, working with CIOs, CTOs, and sometimes CFOs of corporations, is defining the answer to three fundamental questions. Number one, is there technology feasibility today? And the fantastic news is, while we're early days on this vision, working with our partners, there is real meat on the bone uh, to begin this journey to a software-defined data center. Secondly, why do I care? Well, if you're a CFO, uh, the answer that we can help a customer drop maybe half of their infrastructure spend directly to the bottom line in terms of both CapEx and OpEx, um, that's a very uh, compelling, compelling answer to that question. Uh, and then if I've passed those two tests in the responses to financial justification and technology feasibility, it's how do I get there, mm -hmm. right? And how do I get there is broken into two work streams when our organization's working and partnering with customers. First is the operating model of how people and processes evolve. And second is the migration plan. How do I get what I have today into this new environment and into this new operating model? Thank you for spending time with us today, Regu. VMware is very excited about the vision of the software-defined data center and the value it will deliver for customers. For that reason, for several years, we've been building out a team of former CIOs, former CTOs, uh, former industry consultants who are delivering the advice needed to start this journey with a plan for success. Whether it's the financial model, the operating model, or the technology foundation, we're excited to bring that expertise to bear on your journey. I look forward to hearing from you and thank you for your time today. Mm -hmm.